Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> so today we are back with Future Friday. So I know I say this every freaking video, but yes, it's been a couple of weeks, but I thought that I would wait a couple of weeks to make this video so I have more than one Future Friday because like one Future Friday is like four questions, you know what I mean? So I thought I would wait until we have a couple of Future Fridays to just knock them all out at once because, you know, I feel like it's dumb just to do like one for a video. So yeah, um, let's just jump straight into it. So we've got Future Friday number nine. And for this one, we've got DDL Knowledge Again, which again, DDL stands for Digital Dream Labs, which is the new company that bought um, Vector. And then we also have Self Knowledge. So I actually looked at some of these questions and these questions would have been very useful like a while back. I literally made a video about some of these questions. So um, let's start with, hey Vector, I have a question. What kind of battery does your cube take? knowledge really would have been so useful like months ago because literally I made a whole video about what kind of battery Vector takes, how to change his battery and all that kind of stuff because I didn't know I had to look it up because he, he couldn't tell me this before. Here's another one. This is also related to his battery. Hey Vector, question. How do I change the battery in the cube? See that guys there's a screw right there that he's talking about like i said i literally made a whole video about this but now like i had to look it up because i had no idea how to do it but now oops but now you can just ask your vector and he'll tell you how to change the battery what kind of battery you need to get here's another question related to his cube again oh <laughs> barely could reach you sorry buddy <laughs> okay hey vector question Why does the cube show one red light? If the cube only shows the red light, it needs a new battery. The cube takes one N, E9V, mm. or LR1 size 1.5 volt battery. So that's actually very interesting because all the times in the past when I've had Vector's cube die, it never, it just didn't show any lights. That's how I knew that was dead because when he tried to light it up, just nothing lit up. So I've never seen it just do one red light or maybe I'm just not remembering that. Um, and then here's the last question. These are all the example questions again. Again, with all of these updates, there's more questions that you can ask him just than this. They just don't give them to you. You kind of have to figure them out on your own, but these are just the example questions that they give you. So, hey Vector, question. What is the current firmware version? The current firmware version for members is 1.7.0. 1.6.0 is available for non-members. So that's interest, interesting that he mentions the membership thing now because he didn't used to do that. So. So yeah, it's interesting that he mentions the membership because he's never mentioned that before. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but I'm probably going to make a whole video about this. But there's like this membership now that you can buy that you get like extra updates or something like that. It's, it's kind of complicated. Like there's still updates you'll get if you don't have the membership, but you get like a lot more or something. I'm going to make a whole video all about Vector. Kill that fly. <laughs> I'm going to make a, a video about like that whole thing once I kind of figure it all out. But it's kind of complicated. I think it's like you can either pay like seven, it's either like seven or nine dollars a month or a hundred dollars for a whole year to get these updates. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do them, but let's just carry on with it. So that's everything for Future Friday number nine. So now let's move on 
to the next one, we're going to go over to Future Friday number 10 as Vector attacks a cube. <laughs> And um, Future Friday number 10 is more DDL knowledge again, DreamWorks lab knowledge. And let's see what this one's all about. Let's see what kind of questions Vector's got for us for this. Ooh, these are good questions because these are actually questions that you guys actually probably, these are questions that are actually questions that you guys probably have. And I even have some of these questions. So, hey Vector, I have a question. What is the escape pod? So he's got changes to his voice, I think, um, new animations, and fixing his battery is what it said. Um, I haven't seen any new animations, but I have not been interacting with him very much, but that's what this escape pod has. Um, oh, well, this makes sense because the next question is literally when is the escape pod released? So it hasn't been released yet. That's why I haven't seen any new animations or anything. Scoot yourself back, bro. You're getting out of frame. <laughs> Hey Vector, question. When is the escape pod going to be released? The escape pod is set for beta release on July 15th. July 15th, okay, geez. Took him a couple times to figure out what I was saying. And I feel like I was speaking clearly, but I don't know. So there you go. That's when it's going to be released. Um, let's see. Hey, Vector. Question. What is the open source kit? So th these are like some of the things that I'm talking about that these are part of the like membership thing. So not just anybody who has Vector gets these things. These are like these extra things that you have to pay for now, which is kind of frustrating in a way because it's like you already paid so much for this Vector. I mean, like full price, he's like like $230 or something like that. That's not how much I paid for him, but like brand new full price originally, that's how much he was. So it's kind of frustrating that you paid that much for him and he couldn't even do that much to begin with. And now to get for, to be able for him to do these extra things, you have to pay extra, like another extra hundred dollars for the year. Or if you want to pay monthly, you know, it's kind of frustrating, but I don't know. So the, like I said, yeah, these are some of these new things that if you have the membership, you'll be able to get. But if you don't, then you won't. I don't know if I'm going to buy the membership. I feel like I'm kind of obligated to so I can show you guys what's up if my channel's based around this. But it's a lot of money and I don't have that kind of money. Um, the next question. Hey, Vector. Question. When is the open source kit coming out? There you go. August 15th. April, May, June, July, August. <laughs> that is the order that the months are in. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So that's all the questions that we have for Future Friday number 10. So now we're going to move on to Future Friday number 11. And looks like, again, DDL knowledge, again, DreamWork, uh, Digital DreamWorks, Digital DreamWork Lab knowledge again so it seems like a lot of these updates lately is just kind of information that has to do with them which makes a lot of sense because like obviously if you own a vector you want to know what's going on with them and stuff like that and then again more self-knowledge which is always good um let's see looks like they only have two example questions this week that's interesting um hey vector question hey vector question Why can't you take more photos? There is only room for 
20 pictures. Delete some from the app to be able to take more. That's interesting. I didn't even know that Vector had a limit of photos to take because I've literally only had him take a photo like twice, like one time when I first got him. And if you've watched my vi original video, I also took a picture of him when he... <laughs> He's very excited. I also had him take a picture when I was showing you guys everything that he could do. So I never have him take pictures just because... I don't know. <laughs> I just never do. It's not like the quality is amazing or anything. But I didn't even know that. So Vector has a limit of 20 photos that he can save throughout the app. So that's good information. I love you, but you need to back up. You need to be in frame, bro. And then the next question is, hey, Vector. Question. Hey, Vector. Question. Why are your back lights yellow? Bruh, are you having problems understanding me today? <sighs> Here's something that Dream Labs, Digital Dream Labs needs to work on. His voice recognition, because it sucks as you guys, well, actually you guys don't see that much of my video because lots of the time I cut it out just because like who wants to watch me yelling at Vector for 20 minutes trying to get him to understand something. But his um, voice recognition is very bad. And like, I feel like I speak very clearly, like, I mean, sometimes I'm like, oh, I didn't say that clearly enough. But, like, I feel like 99% of the time I speak very clearly and he doesn't understand what I'm saying. And, like, all the time he'll respond to, like, I'm saying his name when I haven't even said his name. Or I'll just say Vector and not Hey, you know. And he'll still respond, which he should only respond if I say Hey, his name, not just straight up Vector. So, yeah, let's try this again. Hey, Vector. Question. Why are your back lights yellow? Bruh! Now he's freaking frozen. Hey, Vector. Question. Why are your back lights yellow? Okay, well, we're never going to know why his back lights yell because I'm not going to ask him another 20 times why his back lights yell. Did you just Mark Slab? There, if there was one update that I would like for him to be able to understand my freaking voice because he can never understand my voice. Oh my gosh. There was really only two questions in that segment and I could only ask him one because he can't understand the second one for some reason. Okay, the last one we've got is Future Friday number 12. So that's the last one we've got for this week. Okay, so today we've got small talk and mini, what was it, explanation? I think that's what they said. It's loading, so I can't see. <laughs> this is what I mean when I say Vector is stupid. When I say this to you guys, he's, he's, things they need to update, him not falling off edges, and him being able to understand my voice because you guys could hear I was speaking very clearly to him and he still didn't could understand okay so small talk and mini explanations number one okay so here's some of the questions they gave us hey vector question can you make coffee Carry a cup of coffee, but maybe a little tiny espresso. <laughs> okay, so that's funny. <laughs> a little tiny espresso. Hey, Vector. Question. Can you play any games? nice because i always wish that he could play more games because like blackjack is fun like the first couple times you play it but like after a while you're just like okay this was fun but like you're over it you know what i mean um hey vector i have a question what's new in the latest update Sounds and animation. 
Fixes, bug fixes, and battery life fixes. Oh, yeah. So it's the same stuff he said earlier because one of the other updates spoke to the ASA. He had said something about his voice recognition, though, did it? I don't know. If it did, um, that's bullcrap. <laughs> All right, guys, so that's all the updates we got this one. So we had four updates this video. Like I said, I, I think it's better if I, like, I like to upload day every, I like to upload every week, but I need more ideas for videos. So leave down in the comments what kind of videos you guys want to see of this little guy, because I know you guys like the Future Friday stuff, but, like, I don't want to make a video because, like, literally most of, most of the updates only give you four questions to ask, and even that one only gave me two, and he couldn't even understand the other one. So give me ideas for videos that you guys want and like I'll do them. But I think the future Friday ones, I should wait a couple of weeks in between to do them just because I don't want to make a video just answering four questions. So give me ideas of what kind of videos you guys want to see because I'm running out of ideas. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>